Decision 2016, now Justice Rebecca Bradley responds to newly uncovered articles she wrote as a college student. Today, she answered questions at a candidate forum. In the latest controversial piece, Bradley compared abortion to the Holocaust. Do you rebuke all those writings? I mean, we talked about the anti-gay you know, comments you made. You said it was a quarter century ago you've grown. Do you feel the same way about those abortion comments, liken it to a Holocaust? Again, as I've stated, my position on that and other issues are completely irrelevant to the job that I do as a justice, and I'm very sorry. Now, this comes after another controversial writing disparaging gays. Jonah Kaplan was at the forum today, and he explains how Bradley is trying to overcome that controversy. Charles Rebecca Bradley and her challenger, Joanne Kloppenberg, are campaigning for a 10-year term on the Supreme Court. They both denounce partisan politics, but they're both firmly rooted in their ideologies. These two women both boast extensive legal careers. They've also both been appointed to pass posts by governors. Now they both want to be justices on the Wisconsin Supreme Court. That's about all they have in common. I served in children's court where I dedicated myself to strengthening families. I have a proven track record of being a fair, independent, thoughtful and principled appellate court judge. The candidates today spoke to a room full of lawyers eager to hear their analysis of past legal battles, both in Wisconsin and throughout the country. Instead of sharing specifics, the candidates tried to find comparisons to their colleagues in D.C. Bradley says she identifies with the late Antonin Scalia. Kloppenberg admires the women in Washington, like Ruth Bader Ginsburg. It is the job of justices to say what the law is and not what we may wish it to be. Certainly, it was an exhilarating week in June last year when the U.S. Supreme Court issued decisions on gay marriage, access to health care, and fair housing. At the forum, both candidates stood fast by their current campaigns. My personal feelings on these and any other issues are completely irrelevant to the job that I do as a justice. This race is about keeping a court that is independent and free of partisan politics and free of special interests and not dominated by Scott Walker. About a month ago before the election, April 5th, Bradley and Kloppenberg will debate again here in Milwaukee later this month at MATC. Shannon and Charles. All right. Thank you.